What's up, YouTube land? Anyhow, yes, I know I'm doing another video, but I just have so much stuff I want to review, so every day I'm just going to po post two different things for my collection a day, because I have so much I want to review. But this is one, my first Spider-Man I ever had. It's a really good one. I don't know from what series, but this is a good looking Spider-Man. Reason I fell in love with it better than the other Marvels ones nowadays. You can get his hand in the pose like he's shooting webs. What I loved about that. He's got a little ankle, little feet tilt. His feet, his toes tilt, and so does his leg. Love that. And definitely love that. Head is like on a really good ball joint. Good socket, I love that. Legs can go out that far. Same there. Arms can go out that far. Not that far. Patient, I can't do much because it's on a single hinge. It's the only problem I have with it. Really good paint skull on the eyes. I will say that about this figure. That's why this guy is my number one on Spider-Man I own. If you like Spider-Man and you know the name of this guy, pick him up. He is great. You can get good poses out of his fingers. That's why I fell in love with this Spider-Man. Web swinging pose or, yeah. He's a little bit tricky to stand, but all in all, great figure. Highly recommend this if you're a Spider-Man enthusiast. Where I got this guy? Um, I got this guy kind of the thrift store. Probably maybe if you knew the name of this guy, find him on eBay. Maybe Amazon if you knew the name. Who knows? And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on.